Hello, everybody. What's up? Everybody get down now. So, here's the deal. Mass Effect's long. Really long. Like, Christ, oh my god, ungodly long. Big surprise. Awesome game, but really long. Especially if, especially if you're doing, you know, a playthrough of it online. So, it's also really talky. So, if that isn't your flavor, here's something that might be more up your alley. This is Resident Evil Code Veronica X. Said by some to be the best entry in the Resident Evil series. I figure it wouldn't be too bad to do, you know, one hour through of Mass Effect and another hour of Resident Evil. And that would give me... Yeah, that would give me a lot. I'll bet you we won't even be halfway through Mass Effect by the time I finish this game, though. Or maybe we will. Who knows? The thing about Mass Effect is it's slow because it's really talky. And I know that, you know, that's probably... You guys are probably sitting watching the videos wondering if something cool is, or funny is going to happen. Resident Evil's always been more about the, oh my god, zombies! So, that's what we're going to be doing here. Uh, I haven't played this game through in a long time. I experimented with it with PSCX2 when I was trying to get it to capture. So, uh, expect some girly screams now and then, because I have no fucking clue what I'm walking into right now. All I remember about uh, Code Veronica X... Veronica... Bleh, Code Veronica X is that the knife is no longer useless. So, um, with no further ado and no idea what's ahead of us, let's dive right in to Resident Evil Code Veronica X. The movie of the game, of the series, of the best selling novel to the extreme. That probably goes in my old save. Should I? Nah, let's start a new one. Resident Evil. Resident Evil. We're also about to see a reason why I hate the second Resident Evil movie. The American Midwestern town, Raccoon City, has been completely decimated due to the T-Virus outbreak that was instigated by the International Corporation Umbrella. Who have really shitty safety Claire Redfield, oh, who arrived in Raccoon City to search for her lost brother Chris and a rookie police officer, Leon S. Kennedy, managed to escape from the city. But their ordeal was only a prelude of things to come. Three months later. number is WKD4496. <sighs> Welcome to your new home. Oh. Her name is Claire Redfield. We caught her trespassing in our Paris lab facility ten days ago. She apparently infiltrated the complex looking for her lost brother, Chris Redfield, one of the surviving members of RPD's famous STARS team. God, these guys are shitty ass shots. <laughs> This is why Alice sucks.
wake up in a strange cell somewhere underground. The lights are dark. I look up. You hear the noise of artillery going off around you. The lights flicker on and off. I stand up and take a look around. There are bars in front of you. The room is dark. The lights have gone out. You hear a shuffling from the door. You see a figure approach you in the dark. It seems to be clutching its side. You back away from the fig yeah, yeah, yeah. you back away from the bars as the moaning figure approaches you. If you were equipped with a lighter, you could see outside. I equip the lighter and burn its face off. case this prison's been taken over. Troops are pretty wiped out. What are you saying? You're free to leave the complex. But you may as well know you have no chance of getting off this island. And what about you? What are you going to do? Don't worry about me. And he missed out of capsules on the floor. It's empty. And made of rubber. There are handguns before you. Do you take them? Of course I do, you asshole. Why would I not take the handgun bullets? The man is unconscious in a chair in front of you. I set him on fire. Aw, oh, man. My name is... My name is... Medical Paris Star Security Leader. Rodrigo Juan Raval. I take the knife. Okay. That's how you turn. Now, I think a lot of people consider this to be the best Resident Evil game in the series pre 